Hi everyone and welcome back. We're about to start a new reaction show called True Calling that stars Elijah Dushku. I don't really remember much about this show apart from hearing about it. I don't think I ever saw it. Uh, from the looks of it, it was only on for primarily one season and a few episodes for a second season and then it was cancelled. I have no idea what the premise of the show is. But I'm looking forward to starting a new reaction show to go coincide with me watching Supernatural season one. I can watch this. She can hear dead people. Is this what the show's going to be about? Her helping spirits. Quite heavy. I mean, being murdered in front of your child. Oh, is she going to miss her graduation? Okay. ...be expected. Parents have probably met a girl. Meredith probably met a client. And my father, no acknowledgement of children from his first marriage. Hey guys, and congratulations. We made it. Yeah. Woo! She does play the tough role quite well. Oh, it is the professor. It took me a second to realise who that was. Well then, don't be a gambling addict. So the family just fell apart after the mum died. The morgue. Yeah. Oh, and look who it is. I mean, I'm not shocked. I don't get why she's being treated like this by her, her siblings. Hold on, why is she getting blamed for everything that's going on? You're the one who decided to gamble. Shot around 10, we found in her apartment. The 32 friends right next door. Oh, it's really smarmy. So, do the spirits call out to her? Is she supposed to help solve how the crimes of how they died? This is the perfect setup for a horror movie. Body in there? Okay. Okay. Now this has become way more interesting of a show. But this is the thing. Is she supposed to help everyone who struggled that day? But her brother got beat up because he decided to go back to gambling. The crypt, this way, right? Are you sure you haven't worked in the morgue before? So this is the crypt. It's true, if you're going to work here, you've got to accept the fact that there's nothing you can do about it. Well, obviously not based on this TV show. Oh yeah, she was a track and field star. So... She can run quite there she is. You okay? Yeah. 
beat yourself up over the smallest things. Bad day, going audition. Actor is strong. It is, it is much more interesting now. We've seen her abilities come out. So you two weren't. Uh, was she interested? Sure was. I flattered absolutely. But those those pictures over there. Are... See, I knew it. You knew something. I mean, everyone's crazy. But you're the most put together out of your whole family. Mm-hmm. Neck, yeah. And I'll be honest with you, Trudy. You don't have to go through this trouble to impress me. So this saved me from a beating. I'm a little faith in your sister, okay? Hey, she played someone called Faith. Charles? Hello? But the wife has, she has the necklace at this point, so when does that necklace disappear? Is it the wife who kills her? You want to know what's worse than watching academics congratulate themselves? It's watching them. Oh, she's also got the necklace. Aaron, what are you doing here? See, it was him. I thought you said you couldn't find that key. She came. He came here to kill you. See, it's not always who you think it is. I thought you were there to help her. She saved multiple lives because I'm guessing the brother might have died from his injuries. Just be thankful you're still alive. I almost didn't recognize you guys. Sometimes I feel better way. Hello. Um, hi. Uh, is this a bad time? Because I can call back. No, it's fine. Everything okay, Dad? Look, we do. No. Yes, exactly. Which, if you have any thoughts, don't forget. Or suicide. There we go. So that was True Call in episode one. For a pilot episode, it was okay. I wasn't really invested at all in the story until the premise of the show was revealed. Then it became a lot more interesting. It was a, 
quite slow paced. Um, you can tell by the film this was filmed a long time ago. Now we know it's 2003. I think I said 2005 at the beginning, which I was wrong. But you could just tell by the film in the way it's all shot, just the color gradient that it was shot a long time ago. I'm not really invested in this yet, but this was only a pilot, but it wasn't a strong pilot. It definitely got more interesting, again, when you found out the actual nature of what was to happen in the show. They had a few nice little twists and turns, not too many. We thought it was going to be the ex-boyfriend, her lover, turns out she killed herself because she didn't want to go on being just a mistress. Thankfully, True saved her life. And it'll be interesting to see what other cases turn up. But it definitely needs to pick itself up. There needs to be a bit more to it. Because it, it was quite slow. But again, pilots are usually not that great anyway. It's just to kind of flesh out the beginnings of a story. I want to see what happens going on because it did only last technically one full season and then a very small fragment of a second. I'm not sure why because this may get a lot better but for right now I'm going to reserve my judgement until I see at least five episodes. I would give this episode hmm, maybe a five. It would have been lower if it took longer, because it took until the halfway stage for us to find out what was going on, really. And then it kind of just went quick. But I have hopes that this is going to pick up. So thank you for watching. That was episode one. And then tune in next week for episode two.